everybody. What's up? Scott Lennox here from Hooked on OC. I hope you've been enjoying our daily coverage of the Mid-Atlantic Tournament at TheMidAtlantic.com. We're there every single night. Who's going to win the 2019 Mid-Atlantic? We've got just one day left to find out. Here comes day four action. Sorry about that. So, uh, six boats fished today. We thought we might see something, but eh, goose egg. Nothing hits the dock. They caught fish, there were some billfish released, but zero fish hit the dock for way at Cape May, New Jersey, and also at Ocean City, Maryland at Sunset Marina. So the board doesn't change one bit. We'll get right to it. Chain reactions, 35 pound Wahoo is still good for first place. A tie for first place dolphin for the real estate and top dog at 33 pounds. Dem boys, 96 pound tuna in third. Stalker still has two beautiful fish, 226 and 207 in first and second place in the tuna category. Looking for a blue marlin. Bunch of people are going to be fishing for him tomorrow. 67 pounds on the sea mistress and the double barrel. They got third pace white marlin. 68 pounds on the judge and 71 pounds on the Uno Moss. Here we go to the Atlantic Tackle Release Points Division. Uno Moss is also leading that 1,571 points. That is some great bill fishing. And then down to the Christie Insurance on the board reward. We're at day four. One, two, three, four. Today was worth a little less than 9,000 bucks again. So we're looking at Dem Boys and Sea Mistress have been on there every single day. They have almost $40,000 in their pockets. Not a good day today, blow day. Most people stayed at the dock, zero fish at the scale. Tomorrow, totally different story. Somebody gonna catch a blue marlin? Somebody gonna catch a bigger tuna than 226? Is that 71 pound white marlin still good? Check it all out live tomorrow at themidatlantic.com. We will watch it all unfold. We'll see you there.